we're going to see my first personal microscope. I'm really excited about this. I have used microscopes quite a few times for research purposes, for teaching purposes. But this is the first time I will have a microscope of my own. The microscope arrives in this styrofoam packaging inside of the cardboard box and it comes sealed with tape. I've already broken the tape seal just to make this a little bit easier. And so let's see what we've got inside the styrofoam. All right, here is the scope itself. It is certainly well packaged. Uh, the whole thing is surrounded with the plastic packaging and there is additional packaging over the oculars, over the objectives, etc. Immediately I can see that the uh, microscope has a diopter adjustment, so very nice. Uh, let's take the covering off of the objectives. This has four objectives, which are the standard for uh, 4x, 10x, 40x, and 100x oil immersion. This has a fixed condenser, but for what we're doing, this should be perfectly fine. The ocular adjustment is really just beautifully uh, smooth. That feels fantastic. Um, let's see the... Focus feels great too, very smooth, very easy to move. Um, we've got independence of the fine focus and the coarse focus adjustment. So that's very nice. Ooh. Yeah, even the movement of the um, oculars feels really quite nice. Um, there is a nice uh, smooth resistance to it. And of course they lock into place like in on any nice microscope, but that feels uh, really quite nice. So what else do we get in the package here? We have little rings for the oculars. Uh, we have two other ocular lenses, which are uh, 25X, of course. What it comes mounted with are the standard 10s. So this is a trinocular microscope. So we have a tube that will help us connect to a camera. Very nice. And then of course we have a power cable. Now this is actually quite interesting. Um, if you can see this power cable is a USB-C. So you'll be able to see that there. So a USB-C power cable, which is really nice because that means you can take a power brick and power this. We also have a standard plug over here if we want to plug it into the wall. This isn't bad for a little less than $700 from Amazon. I have a decent microscope. Okay, so with a very quick look through the scope, looking at a leg of a housefly, this looks great. The optics look clear as can be. We've got infinity optics here. Um, they are plan optics. And so we're expecting a nice, real cl crisp, clear image. And that really seems to be what we've got. So there we have it. Here is my first personal microscope, the Swift Stellar One Pro. This should be a great microscope. Everything feels really smooth. So it really seems to be made well. It's a solid piece. The optics seem really quite nice and a very, very quick look. So I'm looking forward to using this, providing you some images and video to come. All right, we'll see you later.